babe, babe. Now I know what you're thinking. How is this girl gonna pop on my screen and try to tell me how to style wavy and curly hair with her hair all slicked up in a ponytail? I have been so fired up about making this video for maybe two weeks now and it is literally just raining every single day. It's even raining right now. This is the view out my window. Y'all, the thought of Olaplex deep conditioner, styling, diffusing, just to go out in the rain, that life is not for me. So today we're gonna be imagining my hair is down, it's frizz free, it's defined, it's voluminous. Are you seeing it? Are you seeing what I'm seeing? <laughs> Are you starting to see it? Today's video is inspired by a lovely fellow YouTuber named Jamie Page. She did a top three favorites of all makeup products. So top three mascara, top three bronzer, all that jazz. Today we're bringing it to the hair world. So I'll be going over my top three favorite shampoos, conditioners, stylers, oils, etc. And I want to give a big, big thank you to Ritual for sponsoring a portion of today's video. But we will get into that in a little bit. So let's go ahead and jump on in. And of course, these products are geared towards wavy and curly girls. Most of my hair is in the type 2 category, a combination of type 2B and type 2C waves. And my hair is highly porous because I highlight and bleach my hair. And I would say that I have thin actual hair strands, but a lot of it. So I have a decent high density of hair, but the hair strands in particular are on the thinner side. Fair warning, this video is going to be on the longer side. Grab a snack, grab your sparkling water. Let's get to it. And just as a preface, I wanna let you know that I have a vast variety of prices of products in front of me as well. I tried to have at least one drugstore and one high end in every category. I am so super excited to be working again with Ritual on this portion of today's video. Ritual has multivitamins geared towards you and what stage of life you're in. Whether you're a teen, whether you're 18 and up, which is the multivitamin that I take, maybe you need prenatals, or you're in the 50 and up category. Of course, as we go through different stages in life, we're gonna have different vitamins that we need. So the vitamins that I need are gonna be different than what my mom needs, for example. My personal thing about Ritual Ritual is that it is made traceable. So you can see the nutrient forms, dosage, and supplier of every single vitamin. It's not a surprise, it's not a guessing game. You know exactly where everything is. So if there's anything you wanna look up, you can see exactly where their high quality ingredients come from, and that I really appreciate. And of course, Ritual is sustainable. Their bottles are made from 100% recycled materials, and all of their mail outs are made from plant fibers, and even the ink is a plant-based ink, which is really, really important to me personally. I really try to eat a healthy and well-balanced diet on a day-to-day -day basis, but sometimes I miss the mark and I might not get as many vegetables or what have you as I need. So for me, Ritual really steps in to fill in the gaps of my diet when I don't quite hit the mark. And they are vegan capsules and gluten-free as well. If you are interested, be sure to use my code. I have a link in the description box down below, right there, down below, for 10% off of your first three months of Ritual. If you need a new multivitamin without all the fillers, this is your girl. So our first category today is where we start with the scalp. That's right. Focusing on the scalp is super, super important and I think that brands in the year of 2020 really focused on that and honed in on it. I feel like so many brands came out with just so many fantastic scalp products. Uh, the first one I want to speak to is the Not Your Mother's Curl Talk Scalp Care Cleansing Oil. This is a really, really nice, affordable scalp cleanser. And I will have links to all the products mentioned in the description box down below. This product in particular I like because I feel as though it's very, very, very gentle, but it does do the job. So I think that this works from waves to coils. It removes buildup beautifully while allowing your hair to restore its natural oils. It works hard to remove buildup while restoring your natural oils. This product, I love the applicator. I find the targeted tip applicator to be really great for applying the product. This has a slight tingly sensation, so um, it does have peppermint oil in it. If you don't like that kind of like, you know that Trader Joe's peppermint tea tree tingle, if you don't like that feeling, this product won't be for you. It does have a little bit of a tingly sensation from the peppermint oil, um, and this also has an Amazonian white clay and superfood oil blend. This is Curly Girl Method approved, affordable, and fantastic. Moving on to a much higher end product, but I truly, truly love it. This is from Drunk Elephant. This is the TLC Happy Scrub. This product is super, super unique. I feel like Drunk Elephant was one of the first brands to hop on the train of skincare, but for your scalp. The 10% HA BHA blend is going to chemically exfoliate your scalp, but I do want to point out that it also 
has some physical exfoliation as well. It has a biodegradable plant cellulose exfoliating beads to help sweep away the dead skin. So the HA and VHA blend will work to dissolve and get away those dead skin cells. And then the biodegradable exfoliator will work to sweep it away. In my opinion, this product was just light years ahead of its time. It's so, so good. It is a very pricey product, but in my opinion, it is well worth it. Our next product is the only one I don't physically have with me today, uh, but I will be showing a picture. It is the Sunday Riley Clean Rinse Scalp Clarifying Serum with Niacinamide. This product is extremely similar coming from a predominantly skincare focused brand, of course, Sunday Riley. They kind of took the same approach as Drunk Elephant to focusing on the scalp and really helping to get rid of the buildup and, and using acids to do that. This one in particular uses salicylic acid and glycolic acid. And they tie it all together with niacinamide for a little bit of a growth concentrate for the hair. So the Sunday Riley product is essentially the same, it's just using a different blend. So it's really just whatever is best for your skin type in particular. While both products use glycolic acid, the Drunk Elephant product also uses citric acid, lactic acid, and tartaric acid. Woo, girl, I told you this was gonna be a long video. I told you. Okay, moving on to shampoo. This is hands down one of my favorite categories uh, for so, so many reasons, but mostly volume. You guys know the key to my signature look is volume. It's what I love, it's what I do. As we say in the South, baby, the bigger the hair, the closer to God. So I have three fantastic shampoos for you. Starting from the top, my Holy grail is the Not Your Mother's Curl Talk Line Shampoo. I don't have enough good things to say about the shampoo. I've talked about it so many times, so I'm not gonna harp on it, but you guys know this is my go-to if I have an event. If I'm gonna take a picture, if I want my hair to look good, this is what I use. I just, I love it. A new favorite of mine, actually, is from Sunbum, and this is their detoxifying shampoo. It's so, so, so lovely. It's a sulfate-free, deep cleansing shampoo enriched with apple cider vinegar, blue agave, and cacao. It's truly so, so very lovely. I love that it's cruelty-free, color-safe, paraben-free, sulfate-free, vegan, all that jazz. It also has UV protection, which has been a fantastic product for me for the summer. I'm I'm really just such a fan. I'm very impressed by this product in particular. Last but not least, we have our higher end product and that is from Pros. I've worked with Pros so many times on my channel. I really love their products. They're custom formulation hair care. Um, and this is the shampoo. It's my own formulation. It's sulfate free, silicone free, vegan, paraben free, all that jazz. I would say this is the most hydrating of the three shampoos while still giving me volume. It's just chef's kiss. Moving on to conditioner. Baby girl, you cannot have a good hair day if you don't have a good conditioner. If you know, you know. My favorite holy grail conditioner, I, you guys know, you already know, you already know. I've said this name so many times, let's see if I can say it. Shea Moisture 100% Virgin Coconut Oil Daily Hydration Conditioner. Nailed it. Okay, so this is my favorite conditioner. You guys know it is so thick, rich, creamy, dreamy, but I can still get volume. I don't understand what kind of sorcery is in this product. I really don't, because the first time I used it like years ago, I was like, oh my gosh, like I almost tried to rinse it out of my hair. I'm like, dang, my hair's gonna be so weighed down, it's gonna be like straight, uh, no, mm-mm, nope, it's just. <laughs> Moving on to another one of my favorites. This is a newer favorite. It's from Eva NYC. Um, it is their Satin Dream Smoothing. It says shampoo, but I meant to grab the conditioner. Um, so just pretend it says conditioner. It's fantastic. This is great if you want no frizz and you're not playing games, okay? You want that smooth, perfect curl. This is the look for you. I did this in a video recently with the Denman brush. I think that was the video I used this with. It turned out fire. It is sulfate, silicone, and paraben free, cruelty free, and it's so, so good. And also in recyclable packaging. And I kind of have a tie for my third conditioner, bear with me. But this is nice. In this category, we did do all drugstore products. This is the Maui Moisture Conditioner. Um, really any of them I love, honestly, so good. Uh, but this one I pulled because it's their lightweight hydration. It's in the hibiscus. And then the Sun Bum Curls and Waves Conditioner. These two are really, really similar in my opinion. They're just super lightweight. They're perfect if your hair gets weighed down really easily. Maybe you have finer hair texture. These aren't going to like gunk up on you. I would say that this one is slightly thinner and this one is slightly thicker, but they're very, very similar in moisture levels and perfect for wavy girls in particular. If you have curls or coils, I would use different products from this brand maybe the blue line, that one is awesome. 
Um, but yeah, these are great for waves or just low density hair in general. Okay, really quick you guys, I'm thinking of doing something crazy um, and I need your opinion. <laughs> Friend to friend, girlfriend to girlfriend. So I'm considering getting more ear piercings on my left ear, and I wanted, to, I wanted to discuss it. Let me show you the vision. Let me pitch you, and then get your opinion. So um, I have two ear piercings on both sides, um, like one just right above the other. But I'm thinking of getting a third, and then also getting one up here. So there would be four on this ear, and I would just probably keep two on this one. But I think I want to do four on this side. This is the picture of what I'm envisioning for myself. I'm picturing just like a dainty, cute, cool for the summer, hot girl summer, edgy but cute. Are you seeing it? Are you seeing the vision? Comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. This was my pitch. Vote below. <laughs> And be sure to follow me on Instagram if you are not following me already. I'm going to be putting out a lot of video content as opposed to pictures. I'm so over taking pictures. I just like talking to you guys. So it's going to be a lot of really fun video content over there. Be sure to check it out if you are interested. Mail time. Mask time. I cheated. I got excited. Overzealous. We did four masks. Sue me. Okay, so first up, you guys know, I mean, honey, this is the Shea Moisture Hydrate and Repair Protein Power Treatment. If your hair needs a bounce back, if your hair's looking limp, if your hair, if your hair is not curling up like it normally does and you need a protein packed power treatment, this is the one for you, baby girl. It is positively lovely and the price you cannot beat. Okay, next we have another Shea Moisture product. This is the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Treatment Mask. This is hands down my favorite mask of a one size fits all. It can do it all, okay? It'll bring your moisture back. There's some peppermint oil in here to stimulate your scalp. It's got Jamaican black castor oil to stimulate hair growth. It just kind of does it all. It's truly just a miracle product and I cannot recommend it enough. Once again, I will have all of these linked in the description box down below, but this one is great in particular if you do a lot of like straightening, curling, blow drying, even diffusing, just any type of processing of your hair. Maybe you're, maybe you drive a convertible, you're in the wind a lot. Just, you know, anything that can damage your hair, this will bring it back. Now for our high end mask, I have the Briogeo Be Gentle Be Kind Mask Super Hydrant. This mask will make your hair soft, but be careful because it can make it too soft, okay? You know how sometimes your hair can get like too soft to where it's not going to hold a curl and it's just kind of like too soft? I do have to be cautious of that, but I mean, what a great problem. If you're really struggling with dry, damaged, brittle hair, this is a fantastic product for you. It is definitely on the higher price point, but I always say Briogeo, in my opinion, what they do the best is masks. I think that they are just, they're the BMWs, Porsches, Audis of hair masks, okay? So you get what you pay for and they are fantastic. Last but certainly not least, we have the Maui Moisture Heal and Hydrate Shea Butter Hair Mask. Honestly, all of the hair masks from Maui Moisture are so, so, so lovely. They're all Curly Girl Method approved, budget friendly, and just good. You can't go wrong. Moving on to stylers, and I apologize, our light keeps changing. It keeps raining and then the sun comes out and then it rains and then the sun comes out. So when it comes to stylers, for my hair type in particular, I like cream stylers. So I'm not gonna be discussing mousses or like gel oil hybrids or things of that nature. I'm just gonna focus on creams. You guys have seen on my channel the Maui Moisture Coconut Milk Combing Cream. This is truly such a lovely and hydrating cream formula that gives really beautiful definition without weighing your hair down. I've actually gotten my mom hooked on this as well and she is a big, big fan. I love that the first ingredient in every single Maui Moisture product is aloe. They're fantastic products that really work so well for my hair. Moving on, of course, the Not Your Mother's Curl Talk Cream. This has been my ride or die. I apologize if you are so very sick of hearing me talk about these two products in particular as my stylers. I try new products, but like I just go back to these. You know, these are my ride or die babies. And then a product that um, I don't talk about quite as much, but I do use from time to time is the Shea Moisture Silicone Free Miracle Styler Leave-In Treatment with Marshmallow Root. This is such a lovely, lightweight styler that really creates beautiful definition in the hair. Key ingredients are sugarcane extract and meadow foam seed oil. This product is targeted as a leave-in treatment, but I like to use it as a styler. I like the spray pump and it just, it does it. It does it for me. 
Moving on to gels, if you know me, you know I love a very light hold gel. The newest gel that I've been really enjoying is the Rizos Curls Light Hold Gel. It is sulfate free, silicone free, and paraben free. And it's just a really gorgeous lightweight formulation that I really, really enjoy. And it is a Latina owned business. Julissa is the owner and she is just fabulous. She just launched her brand into Ulta and I'm so, so proud of her. So definitely check out her products. And then of course the Not Your Mother's Curl Talk Frizz Control Sculpting Gel it is probably my favorite all time gel. It is a very flake free formulation. That's probably the biggest thing I struggle with uh, when gels have bad ingredients. It just flakes right out of my hair. These do not. Now my moisture has a new gel that I've really been enjoying, but I don't think that I've tried it enough to give it that final third spot. So I'm just going to do a one and two spot for the gels today. Moving on to dry shampoos, probably my favorite category. I feel like you can save any bad hair day with a dry shampoo. So my holy, holy grail dry shampoo is from the brand Unwash. Really any of their dry shampoos work. This is the Curls Dry Cleanser is what they call it, but it is a dry shampoo. They also have just a regular dry cleanser, AKA dry shampoo, but any of the unwashed brand, I don't know, for some reason they just kill the dry shampoo game and they really are my favorite. My next favorite dry shampoo would probably be the Pros Dry Shampoo. This is a very, very unique formulation. Um, I'm so sorry, I just realized that all of our dry shampoos are on the higher end. I will say I really like Aussie dry shampoos. Um, It'd probably be like, that would be my fourth place, honestly, would be the Aussie Dry Shampoos. They really are so, so good. Um, but my top three are all high end. So this is from Pros, and it kind of just poofs out. I'll show you, ready? Here we go, here we go. Poof. It's adorable, obviously aerosol free. It's a super, super natural formulation that just works. It lasts forever because half the can is an air. Um, so even though it is on the pricier side, it will last you an eternity. I'm a big, big fan. And I also like that it's shorter and not as big as a lot of your typical standard dry shampoo bottles. My last favorite dry shampoo is from the brand Living Proof. It is this Living Proof classic dry shampoo. It is so, so good. I feel like that dry shampoo has a cult status and it has it for a reason. It really does the job in such a beautiful way and I need to buy it again. All right, we have one final category and then I have a couple honorable mentions and this last category is oils. I absolutely love hair oils, but I will say that I have a very, very hard time. These are really the only three I think these are the only three oils that work for me. A lot of oils, for some reason, I don't know why, but they make my hair frizzy. I don't have an answer for you, I don't know. Um, but these are the three that work for me. So first up, we have the Playa Ritual Hair Oil. This has apricot and sunflower oils. It's so, so rich and luxurious. You get a lot, a lot of product in here for the price. I do have to say, you get over 1.5 fluid ounces. And this is a silicone-free oil as well. It is probably my favorite oil I own, honestly. I'm just... I'm such a fan, it's a very weightless oil. It, it adds the shine, it smooths, and then it just kind of disappears and dissipates off the hair. It's, it's perfect, it's really perfect. My next favorite oil that is tried and true would be the Briogeo Rosarco oil. I really, really enjoy this oil. Um, it is a lighter weight oil. It doesn't feel like super, super, crazy rich and dense on the hair. The Rosarco oil contains a mixture of coconut, rose hip, and argan oil. If you don't like rose, then the Rosarco line would not be for you. Last but certainly not least, we have the Pros Rose, <laughs> Pros Hair Oil. Um, this oil is really, really lovely. I actually really like the glass packaging on this and the little dropper, I just think it's smart and makes sense. Because Pros is a custom formulation hairline, I find it kind of silly to describe my formulation because yours is gonna be completely different. But when you do take the quiz, they will formulate what works for you and they really, really nailed it for me, especially on this oil. It is like, so good. To conclude, I have a couple honorable mentions and kind of just like random categories. First and foremost, I have Detangler. This is the Rizos Curls Refresh and Detangle Spray. This is chock full of coconut oil, olive oil, and shea butter. If you have a tender head, if you have a child that cries when you brush their hair, this is for you, okay? It's amazing, it has a really nice easy spray applicator. This is sulfate free, silicone free, and paraben free. I find detanglers often have silicones. It's tricky to find one that doesn't. This is a really great formulation and it is literally the only one I've been using, so highly recommend. And last but certainly not least, we have the Playa Endless Summer Spray. This is 
so good. If you're looking for those like beachy mermaid waves, maybe even if you have straight hair, if you add this, I think it would add a little bit of texture to your hair. If you have curly hair, you know, it could kind of like bring it down a little. If you have coily hair, I actually would not recommend this because it does have some sea salt in it. And I think that this would be too drying for your coily hair type. But this is a beautiful, beautiful formulation if you are looking to get that like kind of messy beachy waves. A lot of the times I will add this to my hair. It's called the Endless Summer Spray. It creates soft and tussled texture and that it truly does. Mochi is coming in for the final hoorah. It's like he knew that mom was done working. <laughs> Say hi to our friends. Say hello friends. Say hello. Oh my gosh, wait, I'm dead. I have to share something with you guys. <laughs> Please hold. A lot of you ask how I get Mochi's curls so juicy and plump and hydrated, and I actually do have a dog product for him. It's from the brand Warren London. It's on Amazon. This is the Guava and Mangosteen Hydrating Butter Leave-In Conditioner. Um, I don't use a lot on him, but I especially focus it on the top of his hair because um, he's got a little fro going on. It really helps me when I go to detangle his hair. Um, and then I place it down the back of his spine because for some reason that hair is really coarse on him in particular. It smells positively amazing. He always tries to lick it, so it's nice because he doesn't hate it. Um, and yeah, you can find it on Amazon. I'll link it below. But if you have a poodle or a doodle, um, this is amazing. <laughs> Literally amazing. <laughs> Mommy makes your curls juicy. Yeah, mommy makes your curls juicy. All right, babes, that is a wrap on today's video. I truly, truly hope that you enjoyed it. Thank you so very much for watching. I had so much fun filming this, you don't even know. I feel like, not to say I haven't been passionate about hair videos lately, but I just, this was the first hair video in a while where I was like, fired up. I was just so excited to have all this in front of me and really dive into it. So if you would like to help some of my other, so if you would like to help some of my fellow friends on here, be sure to leave a comment down below saying like wavy hair and then your favorite hair product. So you could say like wavy hair and then Playa Endless Summer Spray or coily hair, Shea Moisture's Strengthen and Restore Treatment Mat. Let's all help each other out and see what our favorite products are. Thank you so, so very much for watching. Biggest of thank yous again to Ritual for sponsoring today's video. And if you made it to the end, first of all, I'm amazed. Second of all, Comment down below saying, I cannot believe Mochi did that at the end of the video. <laughs> and we'll see, we'll see if we can trick some people. All right, <laughs> thank you so, so much for watching. Until next time, we'll see you soon. Bye. <laughs>